Hi guys, thank you so much for tuning in to my channel Vlog Talk, where we vlog and talk. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. If you're watching this video, um, it would probably be Monday by the time you're watching this video. Okay, so I'm going to do a Makeup and Ministry Monday vlog for Monday. Okay, um, and that will be on the day that I uh, send this video out and I hope you guys are having a, a, again a great day and um, yeah we're gonna get into this makeup and then we're gonna get into the Word of God makeup and ministry okay so I always ask God to guide my hands even if you know while I'm trying to make my face and create a look and so we're gonna get into prayer on that and also the Word of God so we won't have to keep going back and forth um, concerning prayer okay let us pray. Heavenly Father, I come before you to say thank you. I thank you for the individuals that are tuning in today. Father God, I just want to thank you for what you have for them. I thank you, Father God, that they are prospering. I thank you, Father God, that their businesses are manifesting, Father God. And every good thing, Father God, is manifesting in their life that you have promised them. And Father God, I just want to thank you for allowing them to walk by faith and not by sight, God. I just want to thank you, Father God, for just increasing them more and more, them and their children children, God. I thank you for manifesting their their uh, spouses to them, Father God, uh, manifesting healing. I thank you, Father God, for manifesting deliverance, Father God, manifesting peace, manifesting homes, God, hallelujah. And I thank you, Father God, for giving uh, the righteous permission, Father God, to, to pray, Father God, for the prayer of the righteous avail it much, Father God. And I thank you, Hayodosha, that I have what I say. And I thank you, call it all done in the mighty name of Jesus, the blood of Jesus. Jesus cover these things, cover um, the things that I spoke out into the atmosphere, and I pray that they have received it, and everyone says, Amen. Hallelujah. All right, praise God. So, we're going to do this vlog, and then I got my sponge, and then, you know, the first thing we're going to do is prime. So, we're going to do that. I never put uh, too much, but yeah, that's what we're going to do. And I always have to remember to powder my face. Oh, thank you, Lord. And as you can see, I always do my eyes because they take more time. And just put some, of course, lip gloss on my lips. Okay, and so forth. And then I'm going to put my hair behind my ear. And then we're just going to rub it in, rub it in, rub it in, and rub it in. Okay. All right. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to use our translucent powder. Okay. If you hear any extra noise, guys, because, guys, it's because I'm by the window. I don't know. This is my little temporary spot. <laughs> so, we're going to powder my face, and I'm actually going to use this thing here. I should have put a shirt over this so I won't mess up my, my, um, blouse. And I told you guys that the reason why I do this is because to keep my skin from um, getting oily. Okay, and I'm going to put some more on this. So we're going to look real ghostly. You guys comment below and let me know if you guys have any makeup tips for me because I can use some. <laughs> As you can see, probably can tell already. Okay. So, well, that's enough. I'm not going to spend too much time with the powder. So, we're going to sit that down. We don't want to get real messy. I hate that. I don't like to get messy. Um, so, we got my found, the foundation sticks. We got the, I don't know if you can see that, but this is the Coco 410 uh, Infallible Proof Foundation Stick. And then I have my 411, and this is chestnut, which is what I'm going to put all over my face right now. 
actually. I'm gonna use the um, cocoa first, okay? So yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys about this amazing story that just happened to me. So as you guys know that I vlog on Mondays and Wednesdays. And so I remember that I was sitting by on the couch and everything. I was talking to the Lord. And he told me that he wanted me to go full time into the ministry. And I said, well, Father, you know, of course, I just need you to, of course, um, you know, open up that door, which I know whatever you call me to do, you're going to, of course, open up that door, you know, for me to do um, what you call me to do full time. And so... Long story short, he definitely opened up that door. Guys, when I tell you that he blessed me financially, get my brush. When I tell you that he blessed me financially to be able to do ministry full time, he did. Did I know how it was going to manifest? No, I did not. Um, he fixed it, fixed it as to where um, I am going to be vlogging instead of um, starting next week full time so you guys will see me uploading videos every single day on different topics okay whatever the holy spirit gives me and so um it is such a blessing i can do this uh permanently full time and this is something that the lord has called me to do and i went from doing it from part time to full time and that to me that's a blessing but it's also a blessing that he you know fixed it as to where i could I don't have to worry about my rent and everything because it's, you know, the Lord fixed it as to where it's paid and I, I don't have to worry about that anymore. I don't have to worry about, you know, working a, um, a nine to five. You, some of you guys might know that I did uh, dentistry as a dental assistant full time. Well, by the grace of God, I don't have to do that anymore because the Lord fixed it as to where, um, again, the finances basically i'm i'm just financially free you know um that money just was i found out money was just you know just it just was waiting on me and uh, the only thing i had to do was claim it i had no idea that this money was just sitting up here waiting on me <laughs> excuse me and so when i learned that it was just sitting up there waiting on me i was like oh my goodness I, I went to thank the thank the Lord red um red den in there guys. I went to thank him right away. I said, Father, I thank you so much so much. I'm so blessed. I'm not gonna spend too much time with this. I just wanna thank you. And so I went on to praise the Lord and everything and all of that. And now, long story short, I will be doing this full time every day. Every day, every day, every day. So, um, yeah, so now I'm going to be vlogging about, um, whatever God gives me to vlog about, um, every single day studying to show myself approved. And I just want to tell you guys that, you know, when God tell you to do something, I'm praying that you're doing it. I am so praying that you're doing it because you're never going to see, some people are never going to see financial freedom until they do. Now, I know that's arguable because some people say, well, wait a minute, you know, um, I'm working the job. It's not what I, you know, what I really enjoy, but I'm making decent money and that may be true, but you will never be genuinely, um, I don't even want to say happy because some people are happy with that, but I just want to say that you'll never really see, uh, the, the manifested glory of God and all that he wants to give you and your family, unless you step out there and do what he called you to do and whether it's, you know, paying your bills or not, because I was doing this. You know, um, and I didn't know how the money was going to come. I just obeyed God. And then um, I worked with this company called Dental Auxiliary. And so I remember that yesterday they um, reached out to me. And they asked me, did I want to work um, a, a particular um, position that paid a certain amount? And I said, no. <laughs> because, you know, da -da 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 -da. I, just, I just basically told them no, no. I'm not. And so, um, I told them no. And 
I was very tempted to tell them yes, but I told them no because... Mm, let me get back at here. Because um, when God calls you to do something, there are going to be other things that's going to pop up that will make you want to take that instead because, oh, it pays more or, oh, it's paying you, period, or whatever the case is. But um, I just took, you know, I just, just made a decision to take God at his word. You know, and I said, Lord, I mean, I've been doing a lot of things that I didn't want to do. It's time for you to, um, for me to do what you call me to do. You know, and um, it was that. I just told the lady no. I told her no. Um, I, that I basically couldn't work the, uh, the position. So basically, I turned it down to do what God called me to do. And um, when you get to the point in your life where... You're turning down money. You're turning down, you know, jobs and things like that because you know your purpose and you're not going to, you know, settle for anything less than that's when maturity has really uh, take it, taken its course in you. That's what I want to say. That you are uh, definitely uh, maturing in the Lord. I know I'm not knocking anyone who hasn't, you know, taken... Um, what God called them to do seriously or anything like that. Of course, I'm not knocking them or anything like that. I'm just saying that when God called you to do something, you know, it's your responsibility basically to do it. And you may not see the finances right away, but I promise you, you will reap if you faint not. And there I've been, um, I know I was talking to you guys about daily confessions and things like that. Listen. Yes, you definitely want to do your, um, I got my little line, <laughs> daily confessions and everything, and you want to act on the word. You want to act on the word, so definitely want to act on the word, and um, I'm actually going to um, just uh, use this part to just pet it on in, because it will sit, okay? Yeah, so um, I'm just feeling blessed right now. You know, I really can't, you know, uh, go by how I feel because, you know, the mind, the natural mind tells you, well, what are you doing? You know, what if this doesn't work and what if this doesn't pay your rent or your utilities and bills and things like that? But you know what? Satan, get thee behind me because this is what the Father called me to do and God dog it, I'm going to do it. This is what God called me to do. I'm going to do it. I am going to do it. And I just pray that what I'm saying is uplifting some of you guys and what God has called you guys to do as well. That you're going to stand on God's word. You don't care how it looks. And you're just going to stand on his word. So continue to make your confessions. Continue to trust. Continue to, to, to have faith in, in God. Have faith in God. And that is my prayer that you would just have faith in the Lord. And not just faith alone is not going to get it. And even faith in confessions. At some point you're going to have to act on it. And whatever that thing is. And what I learned also is. Is that what will make it. What will make the power flow. Even more in you. Is being in God's word. Because you can believe and speak things into an existence and you know the enemy is going to come like a flood. And if you're not in the word, you're going to fall short. You're going to be weak in your faith. So it matters that you speak in the word and everything, but you're going to be weak in your faith unless you stay in the word. You know, the enemy can get you to doubt what you believe if you're not in the word. So I just encourage you guys to stay in the word. Definitely, you definitely want to stay in the word. Stay in the word. So. And, uh, yeah, just stay in, you know, in the word. But anyway, I was just so blessed. And so we're going to do uh, Makeup and Ministry Mondays, as you know, which is what I'm doing now. And then we're going to do... Um, Tuning in Tuesdays, where we tune into the Word, 
And then we're going to do, um, I couldn't even do this whole eye. Um, you know, Worship Wednesdays, and then Thursdays is Thriving Thursdays, and then we're going to do, um, Favor Fridays. Okay? And that's what we're going to do. And I am messing up my nose. <laughs> talking about this and then I gotta go over it with my nose you know so I'm gonna start doing this um I am going to start doing this and then contouring my nose let me know if you guys make that mistake also because I got some of this you see that some of this on my nose and I'm supposed to be contouring my nose and all is well. We're going to get it together, okay? We are going to get it together. And so, yes, um, I'm excited about what the Lord has called me to do and everything. And I know I mentioned for a long time, I'm, when I um, was talking to different people, I was saying, yeah, I'm going to travel the world and spread the grace. And I just, of course, I did not know how things were going to unfold, but it did. So, you know... It unfolds. Okay, I'm just gonna put a little and powder to make it look, you know, like it's looking good. Okay, I don't want to look too powdery over here. Okay, but anyway, yes, I am doing this full time now, and um, I am blessed. I am blessed. It's such a blessing. It is, you know, just to be able to do what God called you to do. It's a sense of freedom. Because I remember when I was working at Bear, um, at, um, sorry, at these different, uh, this temp agency, and they sent me to different places and everything, and I just wasn't happy with it. I mean, they was paying me, they was paying me, um, a nice amount of money, you know, and I was just not really you know mm -mm, happy i wasn't really feeling it so let me contour my nose again i wasn't really feeling it so um mm, look at me but you know i'm gonna fix it um try supposed to be like right here I really only was supposed to put a line on it what what the heck was I doing over here coming all over here so I am so trying you know I'm so new to this contouring the nose thing Comment below and let me know if you guys uh, have a better way I could contour my nose. Because I am trying, okay? A sister is trying, okay? <laughs> hey, I am trying, okay? Over here. So, this is what I'm doing. Um, and then I don't want to look too powdery. So, um, mm, I think I'm okay. So, we're very, very bright under the eye, as you can see, right? We're going to fix all of that. We're a little bright. We're a little bright. It's okay. Mm -hmm. We're a little bright. But it's all good because I got something for that. Um, The next step I'm going to do is... Oh, my goodness. Let's fix myself. I don't know what's going on. But anyway. um, Let's see. The next thing I'm going to do is... Just give me like a, um, bring some color back to my skin and everything. And so I'm going to go ahead and uh, take my, one of my brushes and just kind of uh, go over some things. And let's see. Yeah, I'll take my brush, one of the little mermaid brushes and just, you know. Bring my color back on the skin. And then let me just do my, you know, my forehead and everything. Mm 
And then, um, also, I was going to take my, um, my little Sasha Buttercup and then go ahead and make a scope of. Okay, and then to keep these white lines, oh, guys, comment below and let me know if you guys have the smile lines, and how does it make you feel having smile lines, okay, because I'm telling you right now, it does not make me feel good at all, okay, and so we're while we're letting this sit, Time to do the, excuse me, the face. Did, doing the face right now. Um, the eyeshadow. And I'm going to go ahead and put this liner on last. Um, I have this NYX Ultimate uh, eyeshadow palette. And I was trying to go for something that was very unique about. Because I like this shirt. And, um... I love fashion, and if you guys got some fashion tips for me, I am willing to take it, okay? Um, so, yeah, I wanted to, I thought this that this off-the-shoulder um, shirt was so, 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 so pretty. And I wanted to just maybe do some color. I don't want to do too much color. Um, uh, maybe I can do, I don't know, I love yellow, but I do got a little, I got a little green in here. Um, let's see what colors. Let's open it up so you guys can see okay and i think what i want to do is maybe this color here and then the color next to it that's what i may do and so we're going to go ahead and get into that and then i might change my mind by the time i get to it who knows okay let's just get let's just do this okay uh, this is like one of my least favorite brushes, so as you can see. Uh-huh. It's getting on there. Can barely see it, but it's getting on there. So yes, I am so blessed that the Lord is blessing me to um be able to do this full time. Yeah. Just be able to semi entertain you guys and um just do what he called me to do full time so and i just want to thank god for that i don't want to put a whole 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 lot of eyeshadow on here and i just want to um say that all is well and then i want to uh, continue to speak faith and everything over you guys and um speaking faith is really calling those things as be not as though they were Okay, I don't know why they keep showing, but yeah, anyway. Yeah, so, um, I'm just going to speak something into an existence in you guys' life. And if you agree, just agree and say amen. You guys are prosperous and in health, even as your soul prospers. Yes, I am so blessed that you guys are prospering in, in your careers and prospering in your marriages and prospering uh, concerning everything that concerned you, everything. And so I'm so thankful for that. And then, um, I said I was going to do this. Um, yeah, I guess so. I guess I can do that. Time about, I guess. Because I did say I was going to do that, but I said I might change my mind. And then I'm just going to put it, use, do you guys notice that I don't really use more than three colors? Some people um, like to use more than three, but not me. To each his own, you know, to each his own. So, yeah, so let me know, are you guys barbecuing this weekend or what? What's going on? Because I would like to know, okay, if you guys are barbecuing or not. Um, To truth be told, it's kind of chilly out there to me. The wind is just really, really cold. Really, really cold.
And so as you know, I'm just gonna put it in a crease right here. And I'm just going to blend that out. This is not really one of my favorite brushes. I'm gonna get some, I use some other brushes, but yeah, I'm just doing that. And um, yeah, we're gonna do that. That's what we're doing. And then, like I got some fallout somewhere. And so I'm gonna do somewhat of a cut crease. Um, yeah, and I'm just so happy that you guys are prospering in your business and everything. And everything is working out for you guys. And I am so grateful. I am just so, 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 so happy for you guys. And uh, I want you guys to comment below and let me know what are some of the things that you guys do for a living. And what are some of the things that you guys have um, maybe even um, went so far as to invent. I definitely want to know. And then let me know how can I support you guys as well. I definitely want to support. I definitely look forward to supporting you guys and everything that you do. Everything. All that you do, and that's what it's about supporting, you know. Um, let's see what um, I want. Take the same little um, thingy, and guys, I actually I probably want to do a little yellow, I'm not sure, but yeah, let's. My heart was stuck on yellow. Yeah, I should I do yellow or blue? Yellow, my first mind said yellow. So, I love yellow. I think it's because of the summertime. And I'm going to hurry up and try to put it on here. Because it's getting, trying to dry. And then I want to um, take my time with this. We are wrapping it up. I do apologize about this lengthy video. So, I hope you guys are having some popcorn. And things like that. And just doing your thing, okay? So... We're going to stay positive about everything. And you guys are prospering. God is manifesting the money right now for your rent and everything. And I just want to thank God for that. And so, again, I'm speaking things as, as though they were. Hallelujah. And so, I just want to thank God for that. Your utilities and bills and everything is paid. Do you understand me? And so, we're going to clean all this up. So, And we're just doing our thing clean this up and um yeah yes 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 god yes god yes god yes god and i know i was watching um pastor dollar today and uh i was watching a sermon where he was saying that you know so many people are waiting on god and god is like yo i'm waiting on you all you know i'm waiting on you all you all waiting on me I'm waiting on you all, so I'm going to dust this away. Probably should have did it. Wait a minute, let me hold it on. I skipped a step. Because we were just doing the eyes and everything. And, and I don't know that I, you know, blend everything in. Okay. So, everything is all good. I ain't got time to be messing around with this. So, I am going to uh, take my time. Hmm. I wonder, should I just do it like that instead of doing the whole wing line? You know, I don't know. I'm going to do the other one. I just want to try something different. I am going to um, mm, I like it I like it somewhat <laughs> Mm. 
I somewhat like it. I guess I can do it like that. Try something different, right? Okay, so thank God for this. And that wasn't even my plan. The Lord just got my hands. And then we can get this uh this makeup. This dust this powder stuff off, you know. Um and uh yeah. And comment below guys and let me know. Um, like I said, makeup tips. I can use it. I can use it. Yes, I can use it. Um, I should like that on one side and then on the other side is we are gonna get there. Mm, this side look okay. Going on with this side. We're gonna get there. And then let me just put this in because I don't like it to look like um like it's an actual line there so i'm gonna pat this in i'm gonna pat this in on this side as well because we don't want you know to be looking crazy and i am not look by faith i am getting better at the wing line okay i'm trying <laughs> i'm trying guys <laughs> Um, and then we're going to get into this blush. Put everything back. We're going to get into this blush. And now for the blush, it's going to be my favorite, one of my favorite palettes. Okay, the Lancy. Hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. And then I'm going to see what color I'm going to use um, from this. Okay. Let's see what colors. Um, I'm thinking I want to do this, this peachy color, right? Let me show you. I think I want to do this, this peachy color. And I'm gonna go with my first mine. And this, this kind of light. Let's see. Um, let me see. Go with this peachy color. Um. Yeah, I guess I can go with that. Um, if it is, I can mix. I was just thinking that I can mix um, this color with maybe this color. But um, let me see. Because this one is going to be kind of, we're going to see. Let me see. Let's see. Uh, and then let's see, see, you can barely see that, but if I mix it with this, I don't want too much pink. is pretty i want to put the peach is pretty so i'm just you know rubbing it on in here mm. and then i put a dab of this little um peachy color uh oh this little peachy color gotta make sure i'm doing the right color okay and oh now what color did i dab in that i had no business dabbing in Oh my goodness. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. I didn't want that color. And you can see I dipped in the wrong color. I dipped in, it's so funny, I dipped in this color when I should have been dipping in this color. So we gonna keep it moving, okay? We is not gonna worry, worry about that. 
I'm just not going to worry about that. We're going to keep going. When we make mistakes, we're going to keep on going. And that's what we got to do in life. Even when I'm vlogging and um, I could be so, um, I like this side better. So let me get something to dust this off. I'm going to get that off. Um, and we're going to, um, this side is fine. We're going to fix this side. And I was saying that just like in life, we have to keep going when we make mistakes, you know. Because just like I made a mistake. And I'm going to keep going and we're going to have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful look. A beautiful look. So, mm, um, I think it's a little more on this side than it is on this side, but I'm good. I'm going to uh, wipe some off on this side and blend it out. Got to keep going in life. Mm -hmm. it looks a little better it's more on this side than it is this side so you see what us women go through okay and then we're doing it we're doing it we're doing it right okay we're getting there and so, what I'm going to do is, um, I'm going to, uh, close this. Since we took care of that. And get to one of my favorite parts. And that is, oh my goodness fix this once and for all because I do not know what's going on here with my clothes and everything. I apologize guys. Let me know if you guys somewhat, you know, have had um, little, you know, <sighs> bloopers like this. <laughs> well, you, you, know, your bra, you know, your bra scrap showing or, or whatever the case was. <laughs> anyway, we, we're going to keep it moving, okay? Now, I can use Lovers. I think I want to use Lovers. That's my first mine. And that is this one here. And so, I'm going to use that for my nose. And then, I'm going to... And then, I'm going to put a little on my forehead. Uh-huh. I'm going to put a little here. And then, I'm going to put a little here. Okay, and then I think I want to put a little dab, a little bit more on my nose. Okay, and... And then, we got to put something on the cheeks, which is what we're about to do. And let's do it. No, not with this one. This is not the brush. But the one I just had. I'm going to dust that off. And then let's see what type of shimmer I want to use. I guess I'm going to use the same kind. Because I'm not going to use anything different. Lord, guide my hands with this. Because you know I'm... Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord Jesus.
Okay, we know I went too far back up in here, but uh, yeah. Woo, I got me a, a glow, don't I? Oh, oh boy. Um, we will fix everything. Mm, I'm starting to like that. What you guys think? Um, um, I want to do I leave it here or what? Oh my goodness, Lord, we are like looking like something. Okay, we are looking like a diva. Until, okay, Lord, you are doing your thing with me. And I declare and decree I'm going to get so much better with this. In Jesus' name. goodness i'm liking it myself guys tell me if you like this look or not because we are almost done we're gonna get to these lips and unfortunately i did not grab my eyelashes so i'll put those on um at a later time we're gonna get finished with this and hey we're gonna be on our way okay um so the lips for the lips i have what did i got it behind here it's so funny because i know for sure that okay i'm probably gonna do one of my favorite things to do i didn't drop it in here okay here it is one of my favorites so of course you know my two favorite um lipsticks um i think i wanted to outline it with a red today because i don't even have my red it's somewhere over there, but we're gonna use the um the burgundy uh Nika K uh lip pencil. Okay, and then I'm going to take, mm, I don't even think I'm going to use both of them. I'm going to use one of my favorite ones, which is brown sugar. Okay. You have to play around. With these lips lipsticks sometimes I used to wear three at a three lipsticks you know at once and yeah and we're all done almost let me spray let me spray oh uh oh Oh, it's the wrong cat. It's the wrong way. Now. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, I use regular water to spray my face. And then we fanning, we fanning, we're fanning, we're fanning. Oh my goodness, guys. Woo. And we are done. And let me take my... Uh, next time I'm going to get some uh, hair clips. But um, take my 
hair from behind my ear. I always like to have um all right guys tell me how it look. All right. And that's the water, but it'll dry. And this is the finished look. Guy, I'm telling you, you are the bomb.com. Look at you. You just really doing my ma Man, you're doing your thing with me. I'm telling you. I'm getting so much better with my makeup, guys. Like I said, if you guys got tips or anything like that, tips or anything like that, let me know. Um... I want to learn. There's always room for improvement. And we got to look. We got a look. Yes, we do. We got to look. Oh, my goodness. I'm so excited about this look. Oh, man. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Now, let's get to this word. Comment below and let me know if you're excited about this look. If you were pleased with this look. If you enjoyed it. And just let me know what you think about it, okay? Um, I definitely want to hear so i definitely definitely want to hear it so all right let's move on okay so um i don't know if you, if some of you guys um have read my um uh, first book which is called um oh my god i cannot get my book it's so funny it's my book so it's called uh where's the fire in your desire and so you can find it on amazon and i talk about it a lot and in this okay uh, continue in this particular um, chapter I talk about a situation where um, my I believe it's my right my it was my right breast that was leaking um, like a discharge and so um, I remember that I pray called the prayer warriors um, at my church and um, they prayed with me and they gave me scriptures to stand on and so I began to do that and then uh, within two weeks I went back to the doctor and the doctor checked and then um, had other um, specialists to come in radiologists to come in and um, to you know just kind of make sure everything was okay and they did the even the ultrasound excuse me and so forth and guess what there was no more leakage there was no more anything that it was gone it was gone they felt you know around for lumps or anything there were no lumps there was nothing on the x-ray god choked it into the sea and let me explain what i mean when i say choked it into the sea hallelujah okay so that's actually the topic for today choked into the sea um in matthews 8 28 33 it says that um god met um two men and they were possessed with demons and the demons wanted to get long story short um i'm not going to read it to you you guys got to um, do your reading on your own and check it out so that's matthews 8 28 and 33 where the um demons wanted uh jesus to basically had them to cast them cast them out into the swine and so jesus cast them out into the swine and they it said that the swine had got up and ran into a deep place in the sea and was choked so the the um the the uh disease or whatever the demons were were perishing and what i'm saying is that um what happened when my breast perished because the word perished it the word destroyed it whatever it you know um tried to come on my body disease or whatever or whatever the case was was choked into the sea and the, we know the sea is where the water is the water and the water is the word right and so that's the same thing that happened in mark 5 8 and 14 um same thing there was a man that was gnashing of the teeth and no man could tame him but when jesus came um he said what is your name and he thought that um the leeches were saying well are you uh coming to you know destroy us blah 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 before the time and jesus uh asked the the he wasn't really talking to the man he was talking to what was in the man which is uh the legions and he said my name is legion we are many and uh, they asked God if they could get cast into the swine because it was so many uh, swines uh, before them. And so Jesus had them to cast it to the swine and they went to cast it to the swine. The swine got up and ran into a steep place in the sea. So that's, the twi that's twice that happened. And I'm saying to you guys that whatever it is, 
get, I'm, I cannot stress enough to put the word on it. You know, uh, when I say put the word on it, I mean find the scripture, open your mouth and speak the word and act on the word by giving God praise and whatever wisdom he gives you along with that, okay? Put the word on it. Put the word of God on it, okay? I'm asking you to put the word on it and it, the word is going to get on it and choke it, okay? So, and that's pretty much all I have for today. Would it be healing? Would it be a mate? Would it be, um peace whether it be you're believing for a home whether it be i don't know a job or you trying to step out on faith and do what god called you to do but you got bills like me but i stepped out anyway and god revealed you know uh finances from everywhere i encourage you to do it because he did it for me he's already done it for you by faith i declare it and it's so uh god's not a respect of a person that is manifesting now so that's all i got for today guys and um if you want to um, witness this glorious manifestation where, you know, things are choking up into the sea, like all this danger out here, or these riots and things like that, you're worried, you're concerned, um, you're needing finances, um, you're needing, you know, just believing in God for different things. The first thing, the first thing you have to do is get into the kingdom. You want to get in the kingdom, okay? And with that being said, let me ask you the famous Amos question. If you were... If the world was going to end today, would you be going to heaven or hell? If the answer is no, I don't know. Just pray this prayer, pray this prayer with me. Dear Lord, I come to you now just as I am. You know my life. You know how I've lived. Forgive me, Lord. I believe that Jesus died and rose the third day hallelujah if you just prayed that prayer you are saved and i'm going to speak to your minds minds you are gird up your going you gird up your loins right now you put off the old man and put on a new man you are renewed now peace be still in the mind also and i declare that you are not just saved now you are uh your mind is renewed and just receive that just say amen i receive it and comment down below and let me know that you are saved and now sanctified because you're no longer thinking like the world i just spoke to your mind jesus said Says, speak to it i spoke to your mind and it obeyed and i have what i say okay and then i want to challenge you to go in your bibles and i want you to find the scripture concerning the promises stand on it and pray on it confess it daily and watch that thing manifest and also as you're praying on that thing the holy ghost is going to change your speech so you can receive the gift of the holy ghost amen well that's all i got for today guys thank you so much for tuning in to my channel vlog talk and also um if you found if someone you know might find this message val of a value go ahead and um share this video and also if you found this video of a value and life changing i want you to go ahead and send me um a love donation uh if and it's absolutely optional it's the money sign latoya 090 i will link it in the comment section not comments i always say that i will link it down below that's the money sign latoya l-a-t-o-y-a 090 okay and um, be blessed, be blessed, and be blessed. And thank you for tuning in to my channel, Vlog Talk. And it's always a pleasure to vlog and talk. And also, comment down below if you confess the uh, salvation prayer and is saved, sanctified, and now and um, on the verge of receiving the gift of the Holy Spirit. All right, thank you guys. Bye.